Okay, so here we got my TV. You know, nice 42 inch. Got my games and everything set up. Here's my PS3. I got, um, right here, the first one I got my hard drive, and on this I have just, um, camera and, um, USB. Um, also got some movies. And then right back here is my hard drive right here, so let's just turn it on. Let's grab my controller. Do 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 do. Yep, give it a second. My games and all these I've gotten. Right there is the emulator I have for SNES, and then there's the rebug tool. <laughs> Other games. And there's um app where you can play games. Um, you have to go through most of them. There's package installer. Let's see about that. Uh, there we go. And it says install from the PlayStation Store. Package files. Let's do package files. And it says HDD. That's where you get the rebug tool. And then there's a package folder. I have to make a package folder on your USB, but I usually just put the packages. And Assassin's Creed, the Tyranny of King Mark, and two DLCs, the fix and the DLC. And right now I'm using an awesome PS3 thing, background. And as you can see, it's red, modded. But I don't really, I got banned. But, new version, as you can see, go check out my system update. And that's where you go to update your system via USB. System settings. System information. Four point five megabytes left. Not five, but um, it's like five gigabytes left. Tons. Go so install that. And if you go down over right here, rebug settings, debug settings. And that's all this other crap for online and everything else. Like uh, let's find one. Edit that. Wait, what? Why does this have no way save? Um, game license, that's a little thing, though. Go on license and tell you all about it. And then, delete trophy personal data. I can delete trophies. Um, okay. I can fake plus. Korea legal requirement debug. You don't know what that is. PSP EMU menu. I think that is on the PSP emulator. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's basically this. Give you all that. Let's just check, take a look at all my games through Multiman. Press X. I'm on component HD. But yeah. Volumes on though. Take a look here. All games. I don't have a game this insert. Just a, you know, quick reference of my games. Oh, it's because this is, um, regular. Okay. Okay, I'm just 
because I got actually the Skyline new crap. And then we got, um, Monster. That's, um, Emulator. And it's the Reboot Tool. Box. You go over here, my retro games. Got some PS1 classics. And go all the way up. Support 1. We got Magic Sword for NES, NES. Pretty cool. All work. Uh, let's take a look at. Who's the one? Um. Fire and Sailor. Um. Grand Theft Auto 5. You know, let's see it. Oh, let's change the menu. Oh, yeah, you can change the menu. What the hell? Uh. No, wrong button. Hey, could you have to go to like R1? I don't know. I like this one because it gives you like the XMB of, uh. Um, the regular stuff and tells you some sort of information. Let's go to, uh, the new GTA 5. Let's if I can find it. Oh my god, where is it? Yeah, right there. Right there we go. First X. Loading. That's really saying my USB bus, which is that. Just making sure there's no, you know, to plops. Whatever. Yep. I'm gonna put set up. Hey, look, it's my channel. Damn, 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 damn. Yeah, pretty cool. I thought, yeah. Cameron chair. Oh, and now it's reconnecting. It only happens if you have a USB bus. Now it's so polite. And it says game quit no request event. That's just something says and um right now where that app thing was, Grand Theft Auto Five. Um, I can insert a disc which I use the little player, and it'll say the disc is that game. And we can go first triangle. Apparently first can triangle. Oh, it's not a disc though, yeah. Let's press X. This is the first time trying it on, um, without a disc. Because you just play it with the disc, it's a lot. And I think easier or something. Makes some of the games work. You must be playing Virgin 3.2. Circle out of that, because we can't play it. Duplex. Star. I think it exits. I don't know. I kind of forgot. Yeah, some have that little title intro. And then it goes. Psh. Ooh. Let's go start on this. Let's start. X. Start. Apparently not. I'm just going to be like, oh. Hmm. There's a license information. I'm just going to show you the game, kind of. But yeah, it works, full game. You also can get DLCs and lots of other cool things. PSN, like I showed you earlier. Yeah. Also works for move games, but you kind of need that. Logo. Loading star mode. I already installed it, so yeah. <sighs> Loading takes forever. Game's pretty good. 
played it a few times. Always takes forever to load. Sometimes it can um, go black screen and then go to the game for like a minute. It just depends on what kind of game you got. I'm actually I'm using this uh, new camera. Not really new, but I just set that down. I was gonna use my <laughs> PSP camera, which I did some other times. But yeah, thought I use this. Yeah, the game's still loading. Loading game story data. Apparently still. Can't go through with it. Then I can't jump. Oh, there you go. Aiming. Beer. 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 Take a walk. Random lady. Get out the way. No fucking matter. What? No. No, I do this. Come on, then. That's right. But, uh, yeah, there you can see it's a good game. Shot away in the back. Woo! Sure it goes. Just trying to prove that it's actually me playing. But, yeah, here we go. That's basically it. Rebug!